And there you go, that's the first process on the prep. That's all complete. I went in with a 80 grit disc on a DA and took all the main pieces out on the flats, on the frame, sanded that right down to raw steel and then went in by hand on all some of the intricate bits. And then I went in with a drill with a wire disc on like that and just go in and push into all the welds and clean all these welds up, get all the paint out. And then I went down with a soft sponge 180 disc and then 180 all the steel down from the 80 grit marks down to 180. So that's all good now for the next stage, which will be the primer. We're going to give this a clean down, thorough clean down in wax and grease remover and get this hung up so it's all ready for spraying and then we can hit this with etch primer, give it a nice coat of etch primer all on the intricate bits. We'll mask out the bottom bracket, that part of the seat tube, we'll mask out all the head cups here so don't get a build up of paint in these because that's where the bearings and things are going to go. So we'll give it a nice coat of etch primer, we'll let that cure down and then we can hit it with a 2K high build primer, good couple of coats leave that overnight and then we can come in flat that back and we're ready for the base coat so i'll get set up and i'll stick in the timer just giving this a clean down with wax and grease remover get any grease off of it before we put the edge primer down that's the finished three sort of coats of high build primer I went in nice and light on the first coat mixed it four to one gave it a little bit of extra thinner so made it more like a wet on wet primer with the Mipa and it just absolutely gone down silky smooth guys this is it's gone down really really nice so minimal prep on this when this is dry it'll be a 500 disc just go over the top on all the tubes flat it down and then we're ready for the base coat. So I hope you've enjoyed this episode, part one on the jump bike build. And I hope you can join me in the next one. Don't forget if you're new to my channel, click that subscribe, press the notification. It's helping the channel out guys. And I will see you in part two when we do a little bit more prep and we'll move on to the base coat and logos. See you in the next one guys.